Hey guys, what's up? This is Lipopos here, and today I'm gonna show you my true checkered deck that I've been working and building on for qu quite a while now. Um, actually, I've been wanting to like play this deck for ever since the Mega Team promos um, came out because um none of the Mega Team promos they don't really like affect this deck as much. Uh, I mean, I guess the shifter, it can hurt this deck like quite a bit because um, two Jekyll's present traps, they need to be sent to the grave in order to trigger the effects to like pop back row and, and monsters and the shifter, it just straight up banishes cars. Any card that's sent to the grave and then banishes them instead. So it's a one turn macro cosmos. But even then, I still, you know, like, want to, like, play this deck because ever since the Mega Team promos came out, um, all the combo decks, they, are, like, died down, like, qu quite a bit to the point where, um, True Jekyll's is a viable option to play, and that's why I, I uh, built up this deck. Um, my version of True Dracos is a whole lot different compared to the other Dracos that you guys are, are, you know, like getting used to these days. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna get right down to my version for True Dracos. Alright, so the uh, Draco Monster lineup is nothing out of the ordinary. Uh, three, three Ignis, uh, two Maiden, and the uh, one Dynamite. Uh, um, um, Ignis is by far my favorite true Dragon Monster in, in the main thing, in the main pick by far. But Dynamonite is by far the best true, true Dragon Monster that you can like possibly play. Um, because on um, this card, it just straight up activate two Dragon Traps being Apocalypse and return straight from, from your deck. And the return and this card is currently limited. For that reason being, this car is uh, is like very very good. Um, if at any given time, uh, if Dynamite goes to like semi limited or goes even unlimited, uh, but I don't know why. But if it does, I might say or even made white howling because um Dynamite is a is a water monster. Uh, the three Ignis and two maiden is is standard to get. Tragical special monsters spread from the deck and Diamond Knight is by far the best one. Um I'm playing the Mega Meltron 13 due to the fact that um Solid and Striker they cannot really like get over this card because if you manage to like bring this card out, it cannot be it is on a book that, like everything and it's it's a it's a tricky beater and versus those eggs being striker. Um, Salad and maybe even organs they cannot really like deal with this guy like going first so I'll I like Metatron in, in the main deck so those are the two, two Joker monsters uh, I'm adding two border because this is like the strong the most the best starting opening card that you can like possibly have in this deck because you summon the border activate border and then like the diagram, I mean, and then that diagram is guaranteed the results. Like this car is really, really good. Oh, and those are the monsters. Uh, number spells is the three diagram. The terraforming makes it that so that I am playing four diagrams in the deck. Um, diagram is very, very good. Particularly in my version, is a whole lot better. And you will see the reasons why as in this cyber as it goes on. Um, the three heritage and three Draco Phoenix are uh, really, really good. Part of Avarice can potentially become a part of grid in the mirror. Or uh, you can like, if you're playing smart in the mirror, you can like draw three cards uh, up, up, up heritage and they pop back row up, up pumping pop. So yeah. Uh, they are like really, really good. Six Heritage and six Struggle Phoenix. Really, really good. Um, three Demise and two Pop for Contingency and Draw Power. I know the part of the lady that are common, but because I'm bad, I'm, I'm, I'm a screw at this game. 
Um, the two Joker tra traps are the uh, are the returns and the three apocalypse. Uh, these four traps are like really really good. This is a monster reborn, searchable by Dynamite as Dynamite can also search apocalypse, which is like the my best trap color in in this step because um you can like damage step tactics with this car, and they also uh, pop monsters. Up uh, up bang bang being popped. Uh, 30 summon limit, uh, this, if you going first, and if you open border at this, uh, it, the game's like, like, instantly over, because they can only summon two monsters, which by then you just flip this, and they're locked out, out of their, all of their monster effects, because you have border on the field, and if they summon two monsters, you flip this, is it becomes on Vendor's Emptiness, and Vendor's Emptiness, is currently banned, and this car is basically banned as emptiness in, in like any any combo deck if you're playing against them. If, if they summon the monster, so yeah. Uh, the last cards that I'm maining is a little bit of a spice, and I just uh, taken it in in my version virtual Jacobs, and they are the Ariane and the Conductor package in the form up um three Ariane, uh three Judgment. Uh, two strike and a warning. Now, um, the pluses that you get by popping off the Ariane with diagram is is like it's like it's like huge. So if you open with in my version for Chuchaco, if you open Ariane and the diagram, you activate the diagram, you pop this, you search a two trigger card, and then the one of the solemns. So that's instantly you you're instantly getting two cards, and then if you also happen to open border and the uh, summon limit, um, after resolving the Ariane, and then you get one of the three solemns depending on, on your on, on your hand, and then if you have border and the summon limit in, in your hand, uh, your opponent cannot literally do anything. Because after Oriana resolved, you summon the border, you set one of the solemns and then and then discard, and then you can just straight up pass, or you can uh, summon a uh, two Jericho monster is mostly going to be in this heat or, or, or a maiden if you have on another diagram. And then you're gonna have a border Ignis or, or a maiden and maybe a dynamite knight. And summon limit, and then one of the solemn said, if you just straight up open the summon limit, uh, your opponent cannot really do anything because you have one of the so one of the solemns to stop whatever the whatever that they do or stop one summon, and then if they uh, summon their second monster, you just flip this. They cannot summon any more monsters, and then they're locked uh, out of the. Uh, their monster pack because you you have the border so yeah Ariane is like very very good in this deck so you if if the Ariane with diagram it resolves you taking get, getting um two cards which is like very 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 good and since I am maining the Ariane and the and the judgment um this trade alone makes going first in this deck during game two. It doesn't lose hard to red reboot and and evenly match because you're mostly gonna gonna win game one because if the diagram with the RNA resolves and you you have a summon limit and, and the border like I said the the game's like instantly over and then your opponent is mostly like most likely gonna make you go go first. Because um, you're playing against through Draco, and then if they if they if, if your opponent going first, you're just gonna like pop all, all their cards using the Draco Phoenix, the Apocalypses, and the Her Heritages, and then you gain a advantage of them. So they're mostly gonna side for going second, and then you just keep these in, pop Ariane with the with the diagram. Uh, just straight up search judgment and then set it and depending on, on your opening hand your 
gonna if you have a summon limit you set that as well and then you're gonna have her border and one with the two choco monsters and they cannot even match or raid with you during their turn because you have a a judgment and if you have Ariane in the scale you basically activating this judgment for free because uh, Ariane um in the scale it basically makes all of your solemns in the main deck for for free and the uh, negated summons that that you uh did with judgment or or any of the summons in that matter they can't total the limit of summon limit so it, if you like negated two of the summons with the with the judgment or a strike or or a solemn you flip this uh that turns like straight up over because they cannot summon any more monsters so yeah, um, Ariane in Trichaco, I think it's a interesting take in the day, and I personally like it. It's really very really interesting, and it makes the deck a bit more fun to play because because it's quite a, a innovative take on Trichaco. Because like I said, I I'm gonna say it again here. Popping this diagram is. It's, it's, it's just like so good and if you manage to summon up a true dragon monster you're getting another card cause uh, upper, upper heritage as well so that's so that's three cards and then and then during your turn you just jump a metal shot and if you have the resources do it and then and, and then just kill them so yeah um Arya with the solemn with the solemn brigade in, in this thing is like is like really really good. it's like really really good it makes um going first in the stack during game two, a lot more set because you're not getting red reverted or or lose heart to even the match as well because you, you have access to solid judgment on um, um due to this card. Okay, so um before I get this deck profile like cl close it up, um there are other cards that I'm con consider playing in this deck like um I can play there can be be only be one. Cause it's a good lucky, like, but the summon limit they work better cause I, I'm meaning the solemns. I thought about the monarch syrup, but if you, but if you skip the uh, Ariane and put this all with with the diagram, they it goes to the extra deck. So the mon you cannot even attempt to um activate monarch syrup and and by all means ins inspector border is a whole lot better than compared to monarch syrup. Europe because monarchs Europe can be you know like twin twisters where insect butter it cannot and it can it is going to open it better than the the monarchs Europe can because you need to have a distributed monster where insect butter you, you just summon it and and it is such a powerful card for your opponent to like um deal with. I'm not meaning skill drain. In this deck, uh, I thought about it, but like I said, Inspector Border, it does a job well done compared to the skill drain. So I'm I thought about playing three border in in the main as well, but three border is it sounds a little bit too clunky, so I got it done to just a two. Um, this deck cannot play cannot play Desire because you. Playing the Arane and the Salam Brigade package in the main deck, and if you ban banish the Salam, so your board becomes weak. So this version of the deck cannot open to play, play desires. I thought about playing upset because you, because to make it like more consistent, thirty nine card is is like very very good, and you need to see your opening end to be diagram and the Arane so that you can like continue continue the plus. Uh, I, I. Uh, my first take on on this deck was he started up a, as a main, but as I like continue to start playing this deck like online or maybe even in real life, it becomes like better and and effective. So I decided to like showcase this deck because this deck is very 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 different, and take True Draco to a whole new different look, and also to a another new level take on the deck so yeah uh, don't forget to like on this video and tell me and comment down on the comment section down below what you guys think about my tech for my version of church records it is certainly a different take level and an interesting way to play to play church records in my honest opinion 
So yeah, the same before we're signing up. Peace out, guys. Peace out. Definitely try out Ariane in Ultra Dracos. It's, it's just like so good. Free cars, free advantage. See you guys. Peace out.